Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Rob and um, I'm going to do a video about this, the Mogsoft Surface Dial. So, um, this uh, little gadget gizmo is not, it's not that cheap. Um, it's like 90 quid. I don't know what that is in dollars. And I watched some of the videos on it and it looked amazingly cool. And I wanted to try it out. I've just purchased the Surface Book um, 2 and... I've got the 15 inch version, so I thought, you know, this this could be quite nice with the stylus. Um, I watched some videos of people using it with this program where you pop it on the screen here and you can see, um, you can do things like, you can do the rotation on things, you can use it to zoom in and out. Um, you can uh, use it to select your brush and all sorts of things, which is, um, what's the program called? Microsoft Surface Dial Sketch, I think it is. Now, that doesn't come free. Unfortunately, with the Surface Book Pro, you'd think it would. The amount of money that you're spending on one of these, you think that they would throw in something like that package, um, considering if you're buying something like this to come with it as well. Um, so you, you have to buy the extra features on it. And to be honest, that's pretty much the only program that's really um, supported very well by this. I've tried using it in um, Photoshop. Um, I hope to use it in AutoCAD. It's, really, it's basically redundant in that. It's, um, you can't really do hardly anything with it. There's, um, you can select the um, customizing for it. Um, if you go into settings, um, you go down on here um, in the settings um, under devices and there's wheel so you've got it'll it's basically like a big volume knob you can turn the uh, volume up and down you can zoom in and out you can do a backup and then you've got one only one customizable tool that you can add on this and it gives you options of just holding the control the old or the shift so you can't put multiple when you put this on the screen uh, and you click and you hold it, um, it comes around with the dial and you've got the, the um, you can't really see it on there because it's on, it's all that seems to be on the right hand side which indicates that you would have that on the left, that your right handed person, I don't know whether that, you can swap that from left to right, that seems a bit, seems a bit bad for left handed people, which a lot of artists are left handed because they have creative old lefties. Um, so this, this kind of menu option comes up on the right hand side here um, and you can then rotate it around but you've only got one customizable um, option to add on and you think you'd be able to kind of fill the whole thing up so um, it's a very elegant piece of kit it's, it's quite big, it's very heavy um, it's not something you probably want to carry around with you it's in hindsight really it probably isn't for a portable device it is probably for the big surface um maybe for more sort of professional studios but there and if if it's not being really well supported by photoshop now somebody i don't know maybe there is some third party software out there that gets it working with photoshop so please pop that in the comments below um but i i couldn't get it out the out the box i couldn't get it working particularly well um did a bit of quick research and couldn't really find anything on it so I thought about it and I thought well this is just going to end up being sat in the drawer so um, again I've decided to send it back to Microsoft um, it's unfortunate because I was really hoping to use this especially for CAD stuff as well um, I thought it was going to be really um, really good quite productive and useful um, but it's not the other thing I really don't like about it is it's got this really really shiny sort of surface which um, can allow you it kind of almost sticks to the surface like that and it's a bit sticky, but that is an absolute fluff magnet, and you have to keep the original kind of sticker stuck back on it again, which is like a real faff. So I think this really is designed for like the studio, it doesn't go anywhere, it probably just does sit stuck to your screen most of the time um, on, the, on the big surface. I wouldn't really recommend it for one of these, um, which, is, uh, which is a shame. I'd like to get the big surface. Um, I was hoping that Microsoft may bring out a Surface where it's not actually the whole PC that you can just plug it into your PC and just have like the screen as a Surface because I don't really want to buy a static system like that, spend all the money. I'd rather just be able to have the screen, 
have all that adaptability. So hopefully they'll may come out with something like that in the future. But um, reserved really, I think, for uh, you know office and home use, not on the go. I don't really don't think we're one of these. So there we go, the Microsoft Surface Dial. Um, it's a pretty cool gadget. I think it's gonna get better with time as with software comes out and it gets more supported. Um, maybe in a year or two's time. Hopefully it'll be a, um, uh, much more of a tool. It is quite cool, um, the fact that you've got this um, device that will move anywhere around on your screen um, and you can do rotation and zooming in and out. So, uh, But when you've got a, um, a Surface um, uh, tablet like this, it's probably almost more intuitive or as easy, that doesn't work in this program, but just to do the old pinch and zoom and twist, I find. Um, with your fingers and you don't have to have this taken up your real estate on a small screen anyway there we go that was my review so um hopefully it was uh, of use to somebody um you can't switch this thing off as well um you just pull the back off here and there's the batteries inside um you can't charge it you just have to use these you could re rechargeable so that's about the only other thing i can think about it um it'd be nice if you could kind of switch it off because this thing um if you put it in a bag it does keep buzzing and going off and wasting the battery light. You can see it there activating the screen when I'm doing that. Um, okay, so thanks a lot for watching. If it's been of use, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to watch all my other videos, which will help me out a lot. Thanks a lot, and I'll see you next time. Cheers, bye.